What's good, YouTube? It's Megan Raquel, and you're tuned into my channel. Um, I'm sure you're a new subscriber, so just go ahead and head over to the subscribe button. Subscribe to my channel. Cut on your post notifications for more videos from me, Megan Raquel. Until then, let's get to the video. Back again with a surgery Q&A, surgery vlog, surgery video for all my surgery girls out there. Um, it's been a few weeks since I made a video for you all, but let's hop right into it. So, in today's video, I'm going to be talking about if laser lipo works y'all excuse me this 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 faha and his waist trainer got me sitting up sitting up right i feel like mm. <laughs> he just got me i just came from my masseuse so she wrapped me up and got me on out the door um so before i even you know jump right into it um Maybe you're new to this channel. Maybe you haven't watched any of my surgery vlogs. If you haven't, what are you doing? Go ahead and stop what you're doing. Go catch up. Go look at my full surgery vlog. Um, all my things that I do for all the girls. I give y'all tips. I don't do no gatekeeping. I don't hold nothing back. I tell you all every little bitty thing. Even if it's disgusting. Even if I feel like y'all don't want to see it, I'm going to show it to you. Because I want everyone to see um, and understand how this road of laser lipo is because honestly when I was looking at videos before I decided to get laser lipo I was ready like I was ready to hop up in that thing off of the videos I've seen but y'all when I tell you <laughs> complete different um, experience but all in all I'm still very thankful for it so before I hop right in if I feel like lipo works let me give y'all a rundown if you're new to my channel if you're new to this video, if this is the first video you watch from me, my name is Megan, um, part of the Rich Family. Uh, actually, on this channel, we talk about a lot of investing. Uh, we talk about Forex, crypto, um, anything that has to do with investing and entrepreneurship. That's what our channel has been based off of. However, November 3rd, I went to get laser lipo. Um, and I've been doing a lot of laser lipo videos ever since my surgery because the surgery girls love them. Um, so I've just been coming back with content for you all. Um, I got laser lipo because um, I'm a mom. <laughs> period I'm a mom I actually had two kids back to back so my daughter um, she was born in 2020 um, and then I have my son in 2022 so I literally got a two year old and an infant back to back and you know first off after my son I had a lot of postpartum I was like really like I don't know the hormones was just different Compared to my daughter, like completely different. So he, this pregnancy just did me dirty, okay? Um, and after it, I just went through like postpartum stuff. And then one day I was like, okay, it's time. You know, I'm a mom. I need to get back on my stuff. So I wanted to start working out. So I'm working out. You know, I'm doing all the, the Pilates. I'm doing everything, yoga, everything. And um, that mom pudge that we have, if you're a mom or maybe you're not, it was bothering me, y'all. I'm going to just be honest. It was bothering me. My outfits wasn't outfit. And it'll be a fire outfit that I know is fire but then when I put it on everything looked good until I get to the push part it had to go so I was working out but I kind of got discouraged working out because because the pudge was just pudging and I just was not comfortable with it I, I really just wanted like a head start I said I want to get something done let me get a head start and of course I'm going to be back into the gym and that just goes with if lipo works because it's very very important so needless to say I I live in Atlanta Georgia I went to the Sono Bello in Atlanta, Georgia, and I originally wanted to get my upper abdomen, my lower abdomen, my waist, and my back bra rows. Um, and then I was gonna get my chin because y'all, this chin is chinning. Uh, I just kind of wanted it to be, you know, a little bit more formed. As y'all can see, it's still there because I didn't get the chin done. Let me tell you why. So I went through everything. I paid for everything up front. Was ready for my surgery. I go in for like the pre-op when I'm talking to the. Um, the surgeon, I, my, my masseuse is the GOAT, okay? I'm going to give y'all her information when I'm done here, but she, I love her. Let me just say that. If you're in Atlanta, Georgia, even if you're not in Atlanta, Georgia, and you're looking for a lymphatic masseuse, she the one. She, she the one, okay? Uh, I completely lost my train of thought. Let me think about where I was at. Oh, so I went to my pre-op appointment. And my um, surgeon, Dr. Batuzzi, love Dr. Batuzzi. If you're going to get laser lipo and you're choosing Sonobella, Bella, request Dr. Batuzzi. I hope they don't get mad at me for saying this, but just request her. I promise you, 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 won't, be mad. you won't be mad. She is phenomenal. And I'm not the type of person to cap. Like, I'm not doing none of that. I told myself, if I'm going to do this laser lipo journey, 
I ain't coming on here to sugarcoat nothing. I ain't gonna come in here and tell y'all it didn't hurt. I'm not gonna come in here and tell y'all it was a, as a, it was a walk in the park. I'm not gonna come here and tell y'all that I received a certain amount of customer service, whether it's with my surgeon, the office, or my masseuse, and I don't. I don't do all that capping. Like I'm gonna be 100 with it because I don't. I'm not getting paid for this. Like I didn't get no discount with my masseuse, with, with my masseuse or with my uh, my surgery. Only, only discount I got was Sono Bellas, but with me paying up front. I don't get paid for this. Of course, I get paid by YouTube, but that's it. So I'm gonna be 100. Disclaimer. But I say that to say, Dr. Batuzzi, my mom's a nurse, and I know what it's like to have good nursing or good whatever the word is and she's top tier i never felt like i was bothering her i felt like i was getting a hundred percent completely honest you know suggestions she was phenomenal period so needless to say she told me not to get my chin she was describing to me how my stomach was i knew my stomach was bad but she was describing me like you know if you're gonna get all this taken off and you don't get the skin removed, you're going to be upset. You're going to like your results, but then you're going to want to come back for another round because you're going to have a pancake flap. Now, when she said you're going to want to come back for another round, I said sign me up for that skin remover because I ain't coming back. That's it. Like, I just wanted a head start. I'm back in that gym, okay? So, I got upper abdomen, lower abdomen, waist, back, bottom, bra row, and the ab excess, which means skin remover. It's not a tummy, tummy tuck. It was skin removed. They just removed, removed the extra skin. So that's the rundown of me. That's what I got done. That's who my surgeon was. Um, do, do I feel lipo is worth it? Yes. 100%. Now, I will say it depends on the person. Um, because do I feel like laser lipo is better than a BBL or mommy makeover uh, lipo 360? I can't say that because I didn't get it. But for someone like me, and when I, admit, when I say someone like me, I'm a mom of a mom. Of course, like I just told y'all. So if you're a mom, you may want to, you know, think about it because I have the, the little pouch. But what I will say is, I was already happy with my body overall. I just want my stomach gone, like I, <laughs> gone. But my thighs are. I love my thighs. I got a nice little badonka dunk back there. I put up a picture just so y'all can see. Uh, you know, I got a nice little, I got a nice little shape. I even got the little Coca Cola bottle for it. It was just the stomach. So, do I feel like laser lipo was good for a person like me? Yes, I feel like it was a hundred percent, hundred percent worth it. I feel like it was worth every dime. I'll pay it again and again and again and again. It was worth it. It was worth it to get the extra fat taken out. Uh, and then me work on the rest of my body. My masseuse actually says it all the time. Like, I, cause I asked, her, I was like, did I? Do you think? Cause she sees all kind of people that come in with BBLs, all kind of stuff. I asked her like, did she feel like a laser lipo was a good idea for me? And she was like, girl, yeah, like you ain't need nothing else. So it depends on the candidate. It just depends on what you want done. If you if you somebody that you know you just want your stomach gone, you want the extra fat, you want your extra skin removed, yes. Laser lipo will be perfect for you. If you're somebody that, you know, maybe you got too much thighs. Maybe you got too much thighs. Um, or maybe you just have extra skin. Yes, I feel like Ab X or laser lipo on your thighs is worth it. Now, if you somebody that's like, okay, I want my stomach removed, but I want my butt to sit up. I want my butt to be a little bit more formed. I want my sides. I got dents on my side. I want my sides to be curved out. I, I want my, mm -mm. laser lipo is not for you. Laser lipo is for someone who just wants something small like taken out um, or done. And, and even with that, like if you want to like everything lipo, like your full body or lipo 360, which is what I think it is, Sonobello or laser lipo is not for you because they won't be able to do everything in one sitting. That's kind of why I wasn't able to get more stuff done if I wanted it. Like maybe if I want to extra take it out of my thighs or something. Because they can only do so much lidocaine in you without it becoming toxic. So... If you wanted like more stuff done than what I just said, you will have to come back for another round after I believe six months. I don't feel like that's worth it. I feel like you should be able, you should just go for the things that you want, the the, the few things if you want them done, like your stomach, and just get that done and, and be and be done with it. But anything else, I feel like it's kind of like overkill, and you should think about a different surgery. Um, but is laser lipo worth it for some a candidate like myself? 
Yes, 100%. I strongly suggest it. I strongly suggest Sono Bello. I thought like the price was reasonable. I spent roughly ten to $12,000 altogether. Um, it was about $7,500 for the, the laser light bulb. And it was about $3,000 for the, um, the skin removal. Everyone is different. Like I said, I did get a discount because I paid up front full with my credit card because I get Sky Miles. Um, and um, my your your BMI your price depends on your BMI, so every person is going to be different. However, that's approximately it'll be in that ballpark, low eights, high maybe fourteen, if anything. Um, so do I feel like laser lipo is worth it? Absolutely. Um, but I also feel like aftercare is just as as much important. Um, I'm. I can't stop bragging about my masseuse. I feel like my masseuse is the best in Atlanta. I said it. Um, for one, she's a registered nurse, and that my mom's a registered nurse. So having someone who does like body contouring and lymphatic massages, but then like has a registered nursing degree behind her, she has so much knowledge when she's speaking to me as far as like everything, like uh, the science of the body. So. It's important that you, after, if you choose to do like laser lipo after this video, just if it gave you confirmation, it's important that you have a, a great faha. Your aftercare is so important. So make sure you have good faha, good compression, and you have a good masseuse that really cares about you and cares about your, you know, your end results. I have that and I'm so thankful for it. So if you should do laser lipo, that's completely up to you. However, based off my experience, I do feel like laser lipo is worth it. And I feel like if you're a candidate for it, you should get it. I'm actually going to be recording a my two month post op um, video, actually tomorrow. I'm going to be posting. I'm going to be recording my two month post op video tomorrow, and we are at the end of the video. So Megan Raquel, this YouTube channel is going to mainly focus on uh, my laser lipo journey, along with my daily vlogs. When it comes to being a full time mom, I have three kids. My life is crazy. It's hectic. It's all over the place, and I'm a serial entrepreneur along with my spouse who is a serial entrepreneur as well. You all may know us from our other YouTube channel which is also known as The Rich Family with the D, D-A, The Rich Family where we talk about a lot of investment resources. We talk about Forex, we talk about crypto, we talk about a lot of investing things. Recently I got my surgery on November 3rd um, and I've been just, you know, showing my journey of my laser lipo. It has been a wonderful oh, journey. Shit. I am super happy with my results so far. Um, I'm super happy with my results so far. However, my The Rich Family Channel was made, you know, strictly for our entrepreneur journey, investing things and such. And I feel like my channel was clashing because I was doing a lot of laser lipo and vlogs. So I figured I'm just going to go ahead and make a brand new channel, Megan Raquel, this channel that you're on right now, where I'm going to be posting my entire laser lipo journey along with my up-to-date laser lipo journey. So you're probably watching this video. Um, I'm recording this segment. Um, I'm going to be dropping more content as far as, you know, my laser lipo journey. I am about to be a uh, three months post up here soon. And I'm going to also be doing my vlogging. So make sure to subscribe. Make sure your post notifications are cut on. If you're, you know, looking to get laser lipo, skin removal with Sonobello or whatever um, business you're using for your surgery journey, maybe you have questions or whatever it is. Type it in the comment box. I'm very good at replying back to comments and I do answer all the questions in my future videos because um, like I said, I'm going to be doing way more content than you all see right now. So this is going to most likely be a segment that's going to be placed at the end of every one of my videos until I get to the newer videos. Um, I want to make sure you all see my journey from the beginning to where I'm currently at. So with that being said, I'm going to make sure I upload my surgery day, um, my first week post up, whatever. I'm going to make sure I upload everything for you all um, and then I'm going to continue continue my journey on this channel um, giving you all more up to date content which I'm actually going to be shooting footage tomorrow because I have tomorrow's my massage day um, so yeah make sure your post notifications are on make sure you subscribe to this channel thank you all for tuning in thank you all for supporting and I will see you all on the next video bye, bye, -bye.